They're on the gate. The 2001 Breeders' Crown title on the line. The three-year-old Colts and Geldings are off and pacing in a speedy start, moving out of there. First away is lots of clout. Real Desire is leaving this night. So is Better's Delight along the inside, watching them go on. And following through and forth will be the Bagel Beach Boy. Ameripan Gigolo is fifth, full of fun. Six Classic Air is left in seventh. Hawaiian Cowboy is eighth on the inside. Klingon Hanover is ninth. And one more back there in tenth leaving was the gun that won the West, clearing to the front. Real Desire has made the lead. Campbell ambushed the field and went straight to the top over lots of clout. Better's Delight now back in third. Uh, and this is a compelling story early on with real desire to cut the mile like he tried in the North America Cup. He's trying it here in the Breeders' Crown. Pacing along in second is lots of clout. Better's Delight on the inside from third. Bagel Beach Boy is fourth. Ameripan Gigolo on the inside from fifth. That is full of fun. Sixth at the outside to the flank of a classic hair. And in the backfield, Klingon Hanover just ahead of Hawaiian Cowboy. And to the outside went Gun that won the West 54 and 3 29 seconds in the second quarter and the clash of the three year old Titans of 2001 is on now but this time it's real desire with the lead Better's Delight is coming to him lots of clout on the inside from third Bagel Beach Boy second over Ameripane Gigolo on the inside from fifth Classic Hair is sixth outside seventh and on the pylons for full of fun and it's back to Klingon Hanover Gun that won the West and Hawaiian Cowboy real desire and Better's Delight real desire moving away by two. He might have got rid of Better's Delight. Lots of clout along the inside. From second over comes Bagel Beach Boy. 122 and 1. 27 and 3. Third quarter. Real Desire. He may be up to it, but one more push coming on the outside. Bagel Beach Boy. Real Desire. Bagel Beach Boy. Real Desire and lots of clout. Real Desire had all of the desire. What a champion effort to hold off lots of clout and Bagel Beach Boy and win the Breeders' Crown in 150. Now returned as the Breeders' Crown Champion of 2001. And it goes down as a Breeders' Crown record for a 7 8 mile track competition. It's Real Desire. Life signed three year old Bay Colt from Deadly Desire. Owned by Karen Olson Burgess, Robert Burgess, Brittany Farms, Peretti Farms. Trained by Blair Burgess and driven to victory by John Campbell. That's seven wins in 16 starts this year. He just missed the track record by a fifth of a second. Goes down as a Breeders' Crown record for seven eighths mile tracks, 150 real desire. Well, I wanted to keep him in as long as I could, and then when they started coming back, I had to go on. Um, he, he really raced games. He was, uh, you know, tired mid-stretch, and, uh, you know, I kept asking him. He just kept digging, digging in right to the wire. Just a huge victory for Real Desire, and Blair Burgess is feeling terrific about this as well. Thanks to John, but Blair, after the big rivalry that has gone on all season with Better's Delight, uh, how good does this one feel? Oh, very good. They heard me screaming in the paddock, I'm sure. <laughs> what about that drive that John gave your horse tonight? It was a surprise one, but uh, I did say to John in the, uh, in the paddock, uh, remember Arch Place in uh, Breeders' Crown uh, as a two-year-old. Just caught everybody off guard. Maybe try it again. Did you feel confident, uh, especially after he picked up that second quarter in 29 seconds? Uh, no, I still wasn't confident. A uh, good group of horses behind him, definitely. And, and he had to battle hard right to the end. Right. And for the horse himself, uh, he's been so tough, and I know it was disappointing for you last year as a third-place finisher in the Breeders' Crown. Uh, how much sweeter is it after that kind of an experience? It's, it's very sweet because of the competition has been so tough with Better's Delight all year. That just It's that much more special just to beat a good horse like that. Big win for Blair Burgess. Thanks so much to Blair. And for John Campbell now, 36 wins in Breeders' Crown events. In the Woodbine infield winner's circle with the presentation is Dr. J. Glenn Brown, Vice President of the Board of Directors of the Woodbine Entertainment Group and a Director of the Hamiltonian Society, staging again another fantastic Director of Racing for the Standard Red Division of Woodbine and Mohawk. 
to the connections of Real Desire, the Breeders' Crown Champion. Right up the horse. Yeah, right up the horse. Yeah. 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 Y